Hey, welcome aboard. I'm Seth, captain of the New Hope Camper. On today's episode, the camper's crash couch is getting an upgrade. If you don't know, about a year ago, I bought this 1977 camper and renovated it to get it up on the road in about three months. Now we're going back and upgrading all the details to make it more Star Wars inspired. So as we climb aboard, please consider hitting the like and subscribe button so you never miss an episode. Let's go. The crash couch was a challenge to build. It had had the shape of the iconic crash couch as seen on the Millennium Falcon. It had to be large enough for someone to sleep on and also comfortable enough for someone to rest on. I began the build with the base. It's a simple piece of plywood shaped to fit the camper as well as the shape of the crash couch. I then shaped the four inch foam to that base. I rounded the edges first by cutting off an angle with an electric knife. I then rounded the edges with a homemade scraper crafted from a metal jar lid with holes. I then covered it with a black and white comforter I had gotten from a local thrift store. I didn't like it, so then I covered it with a gray comforter that I also got from a thrift store. I feel at this point I had hit two of my three goals. It was large enough to sleep on. It was actually really comfortable enough to sleep on. However, it did not really look like the iconic crash couch from the Millennium Falcon. So that brings us to today. I'm going to recover the bottom and then build the back with foam. I took my measurements and then cut it with an electric knife. I then used spray adhesive to adhere the two together. So once the cushions were installed, I traced the pattern I wanted. And then I went back and painted it with fabric paint. I chose fabric paint because it's more flexible than acrylic paint, yet remains water resistant. So to see what else we've done, check out that playlist. And to get your ticket for the new Hope Camper, hit that subscribe button. We'll see you at the next trip.